A cinema experience to the stunning capital of Edo State, Benin. Sorry, bye, and you're watching the Film House TV show. Hello, my name is Yoande Oshime, and I present for the Film House TV show. Uh, about myself, I am multi talented. I can talk and irritate you on the red carpet a lot, and I love to do it. I really enjoy that when I stalk you, especially those celebrities, on the red carpet and I ask them questions. But today, I'm on the spot, and you get to know more about me. So, welcome to my world. You might have seen me on the red carpet or in the ghetto, just doing what we do best. All right, so three things you never guessed about me. One is that I can dance. Okay, I used to dance. Oh, I pretty much wanted to be a dancer at some point in my life. So yeah, I know y'all are looking at me like, hmm, this one cannot dance, she's very stiff, I can dance. I will show you my steps. And I'm also a foodie. I love food. And I'm quite the chef as well. But what's so amazing is that some people don't even believe that I can download a huge chunk of bread. A huge chunk of bread without butter, jam, anything, tea, water. I just love bread that much. And no, I'm not Oprah Winfrey. I'm not trying to be like her. I'm quite a goofy person. But when you see me, I'm all put together. <laughs> Three things you don't know about me that will shock you. Um, I talk to myself quite a lot. Like I role play on my own. Like if I'm driving, I actually talk to myself and just act like other people. And sometimes I get weird stares like beside me, but they just probably think I'm listening to music. But yeah. I do it at home as well, very well, like in my room. And you probably think I'm on the phone, but no, I'm just talking to myself. It's just something I do. I'm secretly an Agbiru, so don't let the prim and properness fool you. I can be quite, you know, <clears throat> I can be quite gangsta. And yeah, you wouldn't want to try me like, you know. So that's just a warning for anybody out there, whoever wants to try me. I'm an Agbiru. <laughs> yeah. So another thing that you don't know about me. Um, ch -ch 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 I really, really, really like food. All types of food, good food. African food, English food, Japanese food, Chinese food, Spanish food, Italian food, American food. I like food. <laughs> I was to describe myself with a movie, I describe myself with um, sound of music. I feel like I'm a classic like that, you know, one of those very happy, bubbly classics that you never forget. And it's pretty much one of my favorite, all time favorite movies, sound of music. Yeah. And I can't sing to save my life. 
don't, don't even be deceived by all the, you know, all the songs from the movie. Yeah, but I love sound of music and I love Maria. I think we kind of have a similar personality. I don't know. What do you think? If I describe myself for the movie, it might be hmm, maybe Sister Act. <laughs> What's that song? Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. Hey guys, my name is Chinonso Arubai and you can call me Nonso. Hi, my name is Yawande Oshime, aka Small Genevieve. You're watching the Filmhouse TV show. Hey guys, my name is Chinonso Arubai and you can call me Nonso. Hi, my name is Yawande Oshime, aka Small Genevieve. You're watching the Filmhouse TV show. I really, really love working with Filmhouse. I love the platform. It, the opportunity gives me to meet all kinds of celebrities and I've told you how much I love to stalk them and ask them questions and sometimes see them run away from me. But yeah, it's really fun. I also love the perks behind working, you know, behind the scenes and getting to see all the action and all the things that go on and having all access to, you know, movie premieres and getting free tickets. No, no commas to my job. I won't tell you all the benefits of working with Film House. Just keep watching me, okay? <laughs> my experience so far, was, it's been thrilling. It's been different. I didn't expect it to, to enjoy it this much. And there's just so many people you meet, like, on a daily basis or weekly basis and at the events. And it's just really fun because it's my thing. I love to talk. I love to socialize. So, yeah, my experience has been fulfilling. What do I enjoy most about the Film House TV show? I enjoy looking at my myself after when it's done like oh you know just analyzing and observing and just seeing how it can be better I think it's just I love seeing the outcome basically because we have ideas and you know there's a process but to finally see it all come together at the end is really really it's a, it's a good feeling okay what do I do for fun I'm quite a boring person, I must say, but I'm also very adventurous. I love to travel, I love to dance, yeah. I love to go out, I love to eat food. I'm quite a foodie, I like to experiment in my kitchen and cook, and I love swimming and just, you know, having an amazing time. Literally going to kids' parks and, you know, j jumping on the bouncing castle with them. I think it's, it's a way of reliving my childhood and I always want to be a child at heart. Um, for fun, I I like to eat and drink. I like to. I rather <laughs> I rather be indoors than outdoors. Like I rather sit like at home. Like for example, tomorrow now my girls we have just an indoors plan, eating and drinking. I'm already thinking of you know three a three course meal and drinks. That's that's what I do for. I like to travel, but yeah, I don't get paid that much. So maybe when the money comes rolling in out. Or if anybody has like a ticket just lying around to the Seychelles, you can, let me, you can give us a call. That's fine. But my best movie character for 2017 would be Wonder Woman. I wish I have Wonder Woman superpowers and just destroy all the destroyables in this country. Yeah, especially those people when you go to the market and they're always touching you. I just feel like I wish I had superpowers. You just touch me and disappear. Literally, winty winty powers. <laughs> 2017, I, I, I can't, do you know what, I'm going to cheat, am I allowed to cheat and say 2018? Because I've seen this Black Panther trailer and, man, I don't even have a favorite, it's all, all of them. All, maybe the, the character that Lupita plays, because she's like my, I think I'm trying to channel my inner Lupita, you know? Be on the big screens one day, so yeah, I, I, I Black Panther, man. It's a long story, you know? joining the film house tv platform but let's just say that i knew someone that knew someone that knows someone who works here and then i was literally just um taking my time 
and getting to discover myself and I've been working behind the scenes for some time now and I decided to just chill and focus on me and in the process I got speaking with a friend who knows a friend who works in film house and they told me about an audition they said they were looking for presenters so I was like okay why not if not so I slapped on makeup on my face and wore my finest outfit and I went there and next thing boom they gave me a script and in five ten minutes my madam like ah, one tick I was like <laughs> After 10 minutes, one take. Oh my God. She was like, one take, one day. I'm like, okay, I can do this. Let's do this. And to my surprise, in one take, I actually just, you know, delivered my script. And she was surprised. Like, you could see the shock. Like, they didn't, they never hesperated. it. They didn't see it coming. They never, never hesperated. it. And you know what? While I was leaving, I was like, so just delete every other person's video. Yeah. Yeah, tried to mistakenly delete it. <laughs> I know that was mean, but to my surprise, I was sleeping at home one day and someone called me and they're like, hey, you know, so how are you doing? Yeah, you have the job, so come, come to the office tomorrow. I'm like, really? Okay. I thought, I thought when I go to the office, I'll see like five other people and we're like, no. So we started negotiating our pay. I'll, t I'll tell you that later. I'll tell you behind camera come and ask me how much you're paying me and yeah. i actually work with film one film house so you know there were auditions going on and i was like oh, why didn't anybody tell me I'm, i don't understand so i just walked into production and my boss joy was like eh, girl back <laughs> girl back but like i had to do a lot of persuading and then prove myself like, okay you're on a tryout and if you mess up, you have the door. So I had to prove myself, and um, here we are. Hey guys, my name is Chinonso Arubai, and you can call me Nonso. Hi, my name is Yawande Oshimei, aka Small Genevieve. You're watching the Film House TV show. I get sick when I'm far away from you for so long. I lose sleep and when I. I'll be right back. Don't move. <laughs> baby, oh baby, you're like medicine to me. You give me everything I need. Yes. Baby, oh baby, you're like medicine to me. You give me everything I need. <laughs> <laughs> Proposed by accident? What's wrong? Why are you shouting? Do you want Deirdre to hear you? How could you let this happen? Hello? Is it me that proposed to her? Tell you, say I love you, oh. So what are you gonna do? My money, my body, now your own. I'm getting married. Oh, don't get me no! What is that exactly? Let's see. Three years? Stop me, it's those people. We want to have the wedding next month. Next month? We want to take it to Dubai. We're well, behind you. Just take all of us to Dubai. It's Young John, the wicked producer. Beauty man. Like you so See, yeah, cherish you. I stand for you. I won't lie to you, but I feel life for you. Who are you? Who are you? I am. I am. What do you mean? What do you mean? Valid, valid, valid. Uh huh. I want to come again. Hi, my name is Kiki Gusto, and as you can see, I'm a TV presenter for the Filmhouse TV show. My name is Crystal. 
I am seven years old. I am a presenter in the Queen House TV show. Things that you find shocking about me. Mm. I'm not so silly. Like, it's very embarrassing for me. Like, if I'm on TV or I'm somewhere with somebody and they ask me to do something silly, you'll just see I bust into laughter because I can't do it. I can't imagine doing it. I like dancing. I sing a lot. I take um, musical classes. I also like to play the keyboard. It's kind of my thing. I like dancing and singing. Well, I have very few things I don't like. Aha! When I was a child, I didn't like beans, but it's funny that now I like beans. Like, my taste has changed. And I also didn't used to like cup sandwich, but now I like cup sandwich. And now I can't remember what I don't like. My favorite color is red, pink, purple, and golden. My favorite color is pink. Well, obviously, every girl loves pink. Any girl that does not love pink. Are you sure that girl was not a boy? Because boys don't like pink. But all girls like pink. Like, I'm a pink princess and stuff like that. My favorite movie is Cinderella. If my life was a movie, I would like to be Queen Elsa in Frozen. I think she's kind of interesting, um, protective. She loves her sister a lot and can do anything for her sister. Hey guys, my name is Chinonso Arubai and you can call me Nonso. Hi, my name is Yawande Oshime, aka Small Genevieve. You're watching the Film House TV show. Hello, my name is Jaden Paru. I'm 15 years old and I write the kids column for the Film Extra magazine. Now, usually I write movie reviews, I write short stories, poems. I, do, I did do a bit about cinema etiquette, I think, last year. And so I just try and do a variety of things just to keep it interesting. But mainly the main focus is films. And so when, when I write my reviews, I usually do it before the film comes out, which means I have to do lots of research into the kind of behind the scenes aspect, like who's directing, who the stars are and different things like that. And what I aim to do is to give people a feel of the new releases that are coming out and to also tell them that they can watch them at Filmhouse Cinemas because that's what it's all about basically. So for instance, the new movie Lego Ninjago that came out last month I believe, I waited more than a year for that film because it's actually based off of a TV show and I really like the TV show so I was really excited that they were getting a theatrical release and I made sure that I did lots of research and I made sure that I gave everyone the information that they needed to really get the behind kind of the background knowledge of the film and so they can be more invested in it when they watch it and they can just enjoy it more. So today here I have with me my sister Zara. Zara, do you want to come? So Zara, what would you say has been your favourite film of 2017? Well, I think of 2017, I would say, think Despicable Me 3. Oh, Despicable Me 3. That's, that was a good one. But I felt, I felt it was a bit out of the blue the way Gru had a brother. It was interesting that take they took on it because, you know, with the recent success of Minions, they had to come with something a bit new and a bit different for the original Despicable Me franchise. So I think it was good just bringing in some new characters and showing us around, doing some more world building, so to speak. So I think another movie I'm looking forward to watching is definitely Kingsman The Golden Circle because I think I haven't really had time to watch many films this season because of school and all the things I'm doing, but I think definitely maybe by Maybe by the end of the midterm holidays or maybe by Christmas latest. I'll just watch all the films I need to catch up on and really get into the know of the latest movies. So Zara, what do you think you're going to be doing this holiday? Well, for this holiday, I think I'm going to be going to the cinema a lot more and trying to avoid all those scary movies that you and my whole family like to watch. Because I don't know what you guys like to do about scary movies, but just know if you want to see one, I'm not going to be there. Well, personally, I don't really like scary movies. I know my friends have been like, oh, Jay, let's go and watch it. And I'm saying, no, you 
can watch it, I'm not going to have nightmares with you. So that's just been the whole thing, especially now that Halloween is coming up. I don't celebrate Halloween, but obviously people around the world do. And so films are coming out around that kind of scary horror genre. But I'm not, I'm not a fan of those. But if you are, you can definitely check out Happy Death Day. I think that was interesting, even though I'm not into horror. I kind of like the reliving the day of your death to find out who killed you. I kind of like that aspect. My name is Zara, or Queen Z, and I'm 11 years old. And my name is Jaden Paru, but you can call me Jade the best. And, and you're, you're watching, watching the, the Film House TV show. show. We're fine with the information. If we need you again, we will call you. We will contact you. Yeah? Contact me. Me, I'm already sitting down. He asked me everything. Because if I'm coming back, people will give me transport. Catcher. An ambitious career woman is found murdered on her wedding anniversary, and her husband becomes the prime suspect. However, a police investigation exposes others in her life who may also have very strong motives to get her killed. And you expect me to believe that? You have been lying to me since the beginning of this interview. Why would I want to kill my wife? I loved her. Are you sure, Mr. Blume? You dollar. What do you want to hear? Make I take a good swear? Ross, my God feeling the time to see my husband kill you. I saw in you what someone once saw in me. Something that can't be taught. Kingsman, the Golden Circle. When their headquarters are destroyed and the world is held hostage, the Kingsman's journey leads them to the discovery of an allied spy organization in the US known as the Statesmen. In an adventure that tests their strength and wits, the elite secret agents from both sides of the pond band together to battle a ruthless enemy and save the day. Senate committee will now hear from Jacob Lawson, Climate ISS Chief Coordinator. May the record reflect that he was nearly one hour late. Yeah, sorry about that. I literally had to fly in from outer space. Geostorm. After an unprecedented series of natural disasters threatened the planet, the world's leaders came together to create an intricate network of satellites to control the global climate and keep everyone safe. They, however, have to go on the mission to uncover the real threat before a worldwide geostorm wipes out everything and everyone along with it. Catastrophic weather events on a global scale. A geostorm. Hey guys, my name is Chinonso Arubai and you can call me Nonso. Hi, my name is Yawande Oshime, aka Small Genevieve. You're watching the Filmhouse TV show. Thanks for staying with us guys. I hope you enjoyed today's episode of the Filmhouse TV show as much as we enjoyed filming it. We hope you had fun today guys. Yes, I did. Okay, Crystal? It was great. Yeah, over to you Yawande. So, you know, we had... We're usually we're putting other people in the spotlight, but today you got to know a little bit about us. And next week we'll bring you our regular schedule. But guys, I had such a great time. I think we should go see a movie and some popcorn. What do you think, guys? Absolutely. I think go. <laughs> so off we go. See you next week, guys. I say bye. Bye. said before that one so yeah um